learning, studying was one thing, but at some point you have to start being a professional musician. Yeah. So how did that go for you? I mean, this transition from a student to to a pro. You know, really honestly, I I think this uh, this process is uh, I mean this this thing like to be a professional drummer, it comes automatically by by the <coughs> by the routine mm -hmm. and 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 by several uh, previous recording sessions and and musical ex experiences with different band with different musical styles actually if I want to be a, a really honest I, I I think I'm 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 still learning and learning and learning so to be a professional drummer you know if I if I if I check uh, the stuff of uh, my biggest heroes. Uh, for example, I I had a chance last uh, last September to play together with uh, with Dennis Chambers, who is who is one of my greatest heroes. And that was that was impossible. I, I mean, that was that was uh, an inc incredible uh, experience for me to spend to spend seven eight hours with Dennis. Uh, uh, talking to the bar, you know, you know, in a hotel, and 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 there was and 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 he talked to me just like just like we would be friends since many many years, mm -hmm. and uh, and at the very very end end ending of the conversation, I said like like if if you would know that I I have at at home uh, 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 thick papers like this with all of your your transcriptions and and I took many months with 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 with, uh, with only one tune to figure out like what's going on in a hi hat and, and then he said I'm sorry there was only <laughs> 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 right. you know yeah so that was yeah that was funny he's a really nice guy but but it was uh, that's that's still uh, still almost impossible for me I I, I met with 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 Vinnie Kaliuta in mm. in in January and also with Gary Novak several times so these guys for me are somewhere somewhere else uh, came from from the Saturn I don't know sure. where so so you know yeah. uh, so back to your question I think it's it, it uh, 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 there is no border like 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 I'm 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 a learner and seeking and 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 the seeking person until 2005 January 30 uh, 31 yeah, or something like this so. and then so I think it's it, it's a kind of automatic thing mm -hmm. so but yeah I I did so far like 130 140 different recordings exactly so when when I got back from uh, uh, from New York to Hungary in 1995 I I start I, I started to to do a lot of tours and a lot of recording sessions and uh, my, my very first solo album came out in 2005 and that was the very first time of my life when I when I I put together an album with uh, uh, with with several different uh, guest ar artists and all, all of my compositions and there were like uh, almost 15 uh, different um, uh, artists like guitar players bass players saxophone players kiwi book players vocalists uh, and I I tried to do something which which contains all of my my background music uh, all 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 of the the music from from my 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 musical background mm -hmm. and 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 my new compositions and some previous compositions and maybe there was a point when i when when i realized that okay uh, the, the, the some uh, the some something has uh, started to be happen mm -hmm. maybe yeah yeah right yeah <coughs> so when I'm sure it happens every once in a while when you know there is a clinic or a master class or whatever and people ask you how to make this transition transition and how to yeah. you know <coughs> start how to be a professional musician and yeah. things like that. Do you tell them the same thing or is it like you know an, a piece of advice that you can give them? You know it's uh, uh, they also also ask, the same question with a little bit different dialect. I mean, mm. uh, they they uh, maybe they they uh, they would would like to to hear 
especially something some some stories from uh, for, from my uh, my my years 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 at the classical uh, uh, conservatory and uh, and man some others wanna wanna hear some uh, some information about uh, my uh, my studying time at the dramas collective which was a couple of months so uh, but but basically the the whole story is 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 like this from from the very from from the very big uh, very beginning to 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 nowadays yeah, yeah, yeah. okay yeah. Um, <coughs> still going back do you remember the first kid you ever had yes what I, I have uh, there was a there was a there was a, a piece of crap I mean there was a, like a, a, a piece of junk which uh, like the the drum set contained a uh, different kick drum and different type of high tom and different type of of, uh, of bigger high tom and different type of floor tom. The floor tom was actually created by uh, uh, what's the word uh, the the thing uh, where where they they put the wine was well, it's it's a wood type of thing. You mean a barrel? Barrel, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And and uh, the shape was the floor tom. Uh, wasn't not so it was a bit like this not, yeah, yeah yeah so it's so it was a kind of uh, oval type of thing and it wasn't possible to uh, to buy any drum head for that so we tried to put something to the top with my father so that was so that was uh, that was really funny also the uh, the second uh, high tom was also a handmade one and the size was between the 12 and the 13 so we we had to we had to ask, ask, ask another uh, 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 drum maker guy to create a, 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 a special d a drum head for this drum. The sound was uh, was horrible. I don't, there's no any. Uh, there was no any rezo heads. Nothing. I uh, no in the kick drum. Uh, no, no in the tabs. Nothing. And but I I I I got a I got I got a premier snare drum uh, which was an original premier snare yeah. drum which was which was totally all right I I think I I just get it borrowed from from some maybe from my first teacher I don't I don't remember exactly mm. anyway uh, so that was the first drum set and uh, <clears throat> when I was when 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 I I I turned the 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 twenty my uh, my parents decided to. To uh, to give me a special uh, a birthday gift, and uh, because of I I I was a huge fan of Billy Cobham, and at that time uh, the time a royal star and been a superstar was 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 the the signature drum set uh, of 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 a Billy Cobham with uh, with a huge drum set and three kick drums and everything. Uh, my parents found a royal star uh, from uh, from 1981. Mm. Uh, that was a used one in a drum store, and they bought it. And when I get back from uh, from from the countryside, because at that time I I I I studied at the, at the classical conservatory, I was totally shocked. There was a beautiful drum set on the on the middle of the of uh, of uh, of the living room, and I I I, I started to be crying like wow, what's that? What's that? That's a real a real drum set. That was really really funny. And I, I actually slept, slept, slept with the thumbs. No joke. That was, that, that's absolutely true. And I, I, I set up the drum set, and I, I realized that how loud is the drums because the other one just was just like, like, like you know, it, it's a crap. Yeah. So and and also the 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 thumb drums have a huge sound from 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 the very the very back in the days. There was so the sound was so clear no no any problems with uh, there was great heads and everything so there was that but it was totally great there was a uh, there was a typical like like uh, 22 by by 16 and and 12 13 16 tons and a snare drum that was that was beautiful and actually uh, uh, you can find this drum set exactly the same drum set in my pra uh, out of my practice room today mm -hmm. the sounds perfect mm -hmm. so it's uh, yeah, with 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 clear clear uh, clear ambassador heads it's totally perfect so mm -hmm. no any problems with the sound mm -hmm. fat bass drum sound even if it's if it's just 14 mm -hmm. they're really fat and so so I so I really love it yeah